So we're back, Bloodborne. Everyone, welcome back. I'm at the Grand Cathedral. I defeated Vicar Amelia. I did not record it because I have recorded defeating Vicar Amelia multiple times. So uh, it was requested to me that I just skip that. And I defeated the Blood Starved Beast as well. So I'm here with this awesome old Hunter Bone, which makes me have more of an awesome thing here. It's like I can warp through people. It's freaking awesome. It's savage. I'd like to show it off some more it sucks that it only has a little bit like it doesn't last all that long also i got glasses now because i kind of lost my last one so yeah anyways so uh we're gonna continue our, our full playthrough of this here we go hey buddy look how sick this is look how sad that is I don't, I don't want it to run out, and it sucks that it has to run out too. Right there. Yeah, yeah, you see, that's that's the, that's the problem. That's a common problem with uh, that. I hope the frenzy, yeah, the frenzy won't kill me. Yeah, it'll, it'll just stop. But yeah, I mean, we could go here, but uh, that'll only lead us to the um, Witch of Hemwick. But I want to save the Witch of Hemwick for when I get to Kanehurst when I want to go to Kanehurst Castle because once I defeat that I can uh, once I defeat the Witch of Hemwick I am allowed to go to Kanehurst Castle so um, I'm gonna have to get the uh, invitation to the Kanehurst area so before I do that though um, I'm gonna go continue on to Forbidden Woods with all the snakes and whatnot and I'd like to see if I can attack this guy I know it's gonna be a little tough but hey, why not? Alright, so we're gonna do the spinny attack. There you go. He's gonna wake up. I fucking love the bone. Risky, 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 risky. It's risky business. There's two guys there, so I gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. Hope you guys, hopefully you guys can hear me. I'm having a more relaxed play right now. I'm playing uh, late at night, so my my family sleeping and whatnot. So I'm gonna be a little bit more lenient on the, on the screaming and everything, and I'm not gonna rage as much. But it'll be a nice, calm time right now. Bloodborne. Also, I was thinking maybe I should uh, record face cam sometime soon i don't really have a camera well i do have a camera but my setup looks kind of goofy at the same time because uh i'm sitting on a table right now while recording because my setup is in my basement because my oh, oh, oh i don't want to wake this guy up because uh my hoppage and my ps4 set up down here my hoppage was set up with my ps3 which is down here but when i have my, my gaming setup room is perfect it's fixed and everything just is at the moment it's not really uh, set up to satisfactory level meaning i don't have a tv in there i don't have the whole setup all that good jazz i only have the computer i hate these things man I know it's a rated fine. I love the note system. It's beautiful. Alright, so. I don't remember where we're going. Oh, yeah, this is to the Forbidden Woods. 
So this will bring me to... Oh, hey there. I think this is Alfred, if I'm correct. Oh, good to see you safe. Now, let's think up something to discuss. Just tell me what piques your interest. Talk about Healing Church. Talk about Bergenworth. About the Corrupted Vile Bloods. We're gonna leave. I bid you may the good. I we do I don't want to know much on that. I know everything. If you guys want to know, let me know and I'll go back to him and we'll talk to him some more. Look at that nice, nice texture down there in the, the top right. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna go into the Forbidden Woods, which is for some people. That. We are the old. Blood. For some people, it's just like Blight Town, which I know Blight Town is. is Completely different, meaning it's mostly what pisses people off is the treacherous path. Trust me, I've played Dark Souls 1. It's just like that. I've played Dark Souls 2. There is a type of thing like that, but it's, I, I think it's called, it's different. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, now we're gonna go. I don't wanna fall here. Is there anything? No, okay. Now I guess it's. This is for, yeah, Forbidden Woods right now. Um, to be honest, I'd like to stay with the axe. It's something that a lot of people are asking me to do. But at the same time, want, people want me to change. So, I'll see. Maybe I'll change. Who knows? Um, there's a guy here again. Yeah, I need to yeah, throw shit. Throw shit. I don't want to get hit by that because he can't hit me. Oh, wow, I missed. I need to use the whole thing to go. That saved my life right there. Yeah, that did. Oh, get wrecked, son. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Alright, I'm sounding like a real big scrub right now. Blood vials, perfect. And I know there's, I think, something down here. I don't remember. I'm I'm going through Bloodborne a little bit blind here because I don't remember much from these areas. These areas I did mostly with help. And I think it was my friend that kind of helped me through Forbidden Woods here. Yeah, I'm gonna kind of try to see if I can unlock him. Come on, attack. Yeah, great, great. Oh wow, I'm out of bullets. Yo, his jump length is unreal. Don't do that. Yo, how many times are you gonna jump, bro? Yo, okay, this is, is garbage. Hunter's bone. It sucks that the old hunter's bone is based on the bullets. So that means I'm gonna have to use the setup where I have no gun. So I'll try. I'll try that. Honestly, I think this is just Madman's knowledge. Madman's knowledge. Yeah. Adept blood gemstone. Bruh. I still have yet to use gold pendant, which is Vicar Amelia's thing, but I don't have any other use for it. Whoa! What did I just? Oh fuck! Kind of. Oops. Antidotes. Alright, so, uh, yeah, I do have the one-third of the umbilical cord, which unlocks the secret ending in Bloodborne. Not really the secret, but the third ending, because, I mean, you can learn everything off of the internet nowadays, so. It's mostly of a, a, a alternate ending, a third ending, might you say. Alright, so now that we made it to the light, uh, the lamp, I'd like to go back so I can replenish my... Oh, wow, is there nobody here? Or are they over the horizon? Yeah, they're over the horizon. Alright, so... I'll go back quickly, replenish my stuff. Uh, level up a bit, and then we'll come back quick. So, I just... Whoops, sorry. Alright, well, I guess I'll level up a bit before we end the episode. We'll just see what we can do and what we can buy, level up and stuff. Did get a couple of things. Channel blood echoes. I can do one level up. So I didn't level up my arcane very high. So I'm going to see skill is 173. 174. Mm. 719. I think I'll do vitality. No, you know what? I'm going to do some strength. I'm going to do strength because I need it. I want to be more of a beefy class where it goes like a brute. The health doesn't really matter to me. I think the health. But yeah, I also... <laughs> 
I did the DLC stuff and uh, I got a beast cutter, but honestly, it's complete trash. I think it's one of the worst weapons of the game, to be honest. Um, yeah, I have three out of five bloods, uh, twin bloods, oh, sorry, shards. Yeah, to be honest, it's one of the shittiest weapons I've ever come across. I went to the DLC area, tried fighting an enemy, and got my ass handed to me by the first enemy. So, I don't really recommend going there, <laughs> to be honest. I'm just gonna check the blood gems right now. This is literally all I have. Oh, I have this, so yeah, I guess. I'll do that. Nice. Alright, so blunt is 66 plus 66. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna just yeah boost rally potential. There you go. There you go. So my weapon is pretty strong to be honest. It's at 134 plus 49, which is a pretty good amount of damage. To be honest, I like I like this axe. I like this axe. But since I got the pig, the saw hunter badge, I do have a choice between saw cleaver, saw spear, which I got. Hunter Axe, Threaded Cane, Beast Cutter, Kirk Hammer, and Ludwig's Holy Blade. If you guys would like me to try Ludwig's Holy Blade, because I know that it's a very, very good weapon. Especially when you get the Empty Phasm cell or whatever. Uh, it gets really good. So, if you guys want me to use Ludwig's Holy Blade, I'll do that. If you guys want me to use the Kirk Hammer, I'll do that just as well. If you want me to use the Threaded Cane, any one of these weapons. Or if you want to just want me to stick with the Hunter Axe, I'll do just that. Also, I have Ludwig's Rifle. Uh, which I think I'm gonna get flame sprayer. I don't know. I don't know how I got these to be honest a Hunter blunderbuss Etc, etc. And uh, yeah, so if you guys want me to use those Let me know down in the comment section below and if so I'll grind a bit and I'll get those items But as always, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed if you have make sure to leave a like down below Favorite and subscribe also make sure to comment down below what I should buy and where I should go next and as always Thank you all so much for watching. See ya